place, I want you to accept my proposal. I promise to treat you right, eh? I don't mind splashing my salary on you, no? I'll treat you as a queen that you are. Eh? Just say yes to me. Alex, you know you are very, very funny. Like, very funny. Really? How can you even be thinking of getting married to me when you work in a restaurant as a common waiter? Okay, okay. When babies start coming, how are we going to take care of them? Babies. Uh-huh. When we get there, we will cross that bridge. Then, for now, all you have to do is to say yes to me. Eh? Give me access to your body, give me access to your heart, give me access to everything. Eh? Alex! Yes, how can a male servant like you stand here and be trying to woo a lady? What is wrong with you? Well, no, I was trying to get a... Uh, oh, what, hey, what, what were you trying to do? What were you trying to do? What were you trying to do? <sighs> ah. so, it was a dream. Yeah. Ah, uh, uh, madam. Um, how much is my money? Uh, okay. One minute. Let me confirm the total amount. I'll be back. Okay. Yeah. Um, the total amount is four thousand naira. Four thousand. Okay. Like that. Oh, pardon my manners. It's just that you look like someone I know, and I like you. You're pretty. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Hope it's complete. Uh, yes. All right. See you, Samarata. Hurry up and wash the place. Our customers are waiting to be served. And be fast about it so they can go and prepare the fire and boil some meat. Please go, go, go. Okay, I'm on this, ma'am. I am on this. Hurry, I'm please. Ha! Please hurry. Chai. Hey, yeah. Chai. Ma, please. You can't keep crying like this, like a baby. Hey, or one of those girls in the streets that doesn't have hope in life. Please. Please. Stop crying. Vivian. Ma. How do I explain that? I've lost another guy. This is making it the seventh guy that I've lost this year. What is happening to me? <laughs> Am I even meant to be loved by a man? Oh, my, you are a very good woman. A 
very beautiful one at that. I want to believe that none of those men was meant for you. They don't deserve you. All they came, they come to you because of what they stand to gain. But I give them my all despite everything. I give them my body, my soul, my everything. Ma, please. You have to stop them from coming to you. I mean, can't you see? They are hurting you. Stop them. Don't be so kind. Vivian, I am not getting any younger. I need a man by my side. You know this country that we live in. No matter the amount of wealth you have, or even any height you are if you don't have a man, you are as good as worthless. Chai. <coughs> Whatever did I do to deserve all this heartbreak from this man? <coughs> Chai, Mark, I feel like crying, honestly. You are saying nothing but the truth. But please, you have to let them understand that you are not a fool. Look at you. Huh? Man, no man what is your beautiful tears. None of them worth crying for or dying for. Imagine if Annie just came and all of a sudden he just disappeared. The same thing happened to Kay and Benson and Johnson and the rest of them. <laughs> shh, 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 shh. But it's okay. It's okay, ma. All I'm telling you is you have to stop being so caring, so nice, so given. Just, 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 just be you, so that you can know if these men are coming to love you or they are coming to enrich themselves and just disappeared. Look, ma, don't forget you're still in the office. What if Klein walks in now and see you like this? Please clean those beautiful tears. What would they think? Thank you. I'm so sorry, ma. I feel like crying too. So let, let me just hurry and get you water. It's okay, I'm fine. No, you're not. Let me get you something. Sorry. This one is for my parents. This other one will be for my upkeep. The rest will go into my savings. Very soon, I will get hooked up with someone and I don't want money to be an obstacle to it. Mm. So you mean this current guy has done Madame Minda? <coughs> My dear. That's why I see him. Now so me too to follow Sia. Ah, if you see the way she was crying. Ha! If not that I went to console her, who knows what would have happened to her? Let her keep crying, that's her business. But why? Why does she have to suffer like this? Do you know that 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 lady? She's so innocent. She's so kind, hardworking. I wonder why men treat her treat her that badly. Yeah. Hmm. Why men so wicked? <laughs> men are very ungrateful. Men are very ungrateful. So ungrateful. <clears throat> My dear. I just pray that she finds a, a true love because that lady has suffered enough. For she has truly suffered. Well, me I don't pity her at all. Though. I don't pity her. Yes, why she's busy giving her that money, men are busy making her out. That's her business, not my own. 
Are you serious? Vivian. Yes. Yes. But were you not the one that told me you were consoling her? Me. <laughs> I don't console myself, finish. My dear, I was only pretending. Not pretend that they do. Which kind console? Now me do I break her heart. I beg. Don't tell me you're jealous of her. Joy, are you okay? Jealous of her? For what? Eh? Why should I be jealous of her? She is still our boss. So? She deserves respect. Hmm. Don't speak about her like that. Joy. So for the fact that she is our boss, what do you want me to do? Eh? Is that why she's giving her money out? Oh, besides, are we not working to earn our money? We are working for it. So why are you sounding as if she's dashing us the money? If she's dashing you, me, I'm working for it. Huh? Fuck out of here. Joy. Hmm? Stay here. And madame, they look for you everywhere. Huh? Are you serious? I'm not serious. I didn't call me my phone. Let's go now. Yeah, go. Go now, your madam will find you. <coughs> hey! This is a propolis too. Hey. Why this girl like to stand here? They gossip for this company all the time. Hey! Women, they like gossip. Ah! Now they are occupational. To the gossip everywhere, then go gossip, gossip. Uh... I never knew you could do this to me. Babe, I still plead you to forget about it. Why are you trying to remind me of the past? Why are you just trying to use reverse psychology on me? You are the one that offended me. And now you even act like nothing happened. Do you know the implications of what you did? I know. Babe, come on, I know. I know what I did was wrong, but you're taking this whole thing too far, babe. You're taking it too far. Really? So you want me to clap for you for all you did? You want me to clap for you for cheating on me, right? Listen, you do not love me. And you have no plans of getting married to me. I virtually did everything for you. I paid your bills, your house rent, down to the phone you have here. And you pay me back this way. I am so, I am sorry, babe. I am sorry. It's not what you think. I still love you. Babe, I love you. Spare me all that bullshit. I do not want to listen to that nonsense. Listen, this is an office. And discussions like this do not go well here. You are distracting me. Leave. Seriously, accent me to you. God, the God, you are pleased in your luck. God, the God, you are pleased in your luck. Greedy people, you are pleased in your luck. Selfish people, you are pleased in your luck. Bloody cheat. Waitress, please bring another rod lamp. Oh, brewery, you may stop big time. You know, I, I, I. I will always tell the truth, bro. You fucked up. Eh? After everything you told me about this particular lady, you told me this lady was, she was a messiah. She was your all and all. She was doing everything thing for you. Bro, so now, how could you? How could you stab her with a dagger on her heart? Bro, how? Look. Jude, my head is filled right now. You think I didn't know that I messed up? No, I messed up. I didn't know she was going to take it this far. I didn't know she was going to take it to this nation. 
I didn't know I wouldn't have done it. How I wish I know this lady in question, bro. How I wish I knew her. I would have, I would have apologized to this lady on her own behalf. Mike, you know what? I think you should go back to this lady. Yeah, kneel down. I protest to her properly. I think she will consider you back. I should know that. Yeah. And you think I haven't done that? Judah, I have knelt down. I have begged Linda, I have begged her. But she refuses to accept my apology. You know what? Uh, we have a meeting this evening at a house, so I hope everything is gonna go well this evening. I'm just hoping. Yeah. That's a nice idea. That's where I come in. I think I I I, I should go with you to personally address this lady on your own behalf. Let me go with you, bro. Don't worry, it's not your time. Once it's time, I will let you know. It's my cross, you know. Let me exhaust my energy first, then if I need a third party, I will know. You know I'm your bro, right? I've got you. I know you've got me. If you say so, I don't have any problem with that. Okay? Thanks for being there for me too. <laughs> you know, I can't tell you that I read to you. Thanks, man. Uh, madam, this is for the food and this okay. is for bottled water. What about the one for the drinks? Um, okay, she is the one handling it. Alex. Madam. Alex, when I was leaving here in the morning, I asked you to take care of this place. You said so, madam. Uh -huh. Okay, um, in that case, I'll have to tell her. So that she will total the whole amount and bring it to you with the record. Ha! Better. Um, was the meat seller here today? Yes, yes, he was. Okay. Uh, he brought the bits. I have kept them in the fridge. All right. Tomorrow. All right. So please hurry up with the other accounts. Let me go on my rest. Oh? Okay, ma'am. Do that right here. All right. All right. Do I know you from somewhere? No, 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 I don't. Actually, I, I saw you from the supermarket. I had to say hi. I see. Sorry, um, you look beautiful. Thank you. All right. So I was hoping if I can get to know you, you know, we can actually do business. Hmm, business? Yeah. Are you an agent? Agent of what? I mean, are you into clearing and forwarding? Oh, oh, oh no, not yet, but... I'm hoping to go into it soon. Okay. Well, my name is Linda. Okay. And this is my car. You can call me and hope to do business with you. All right, no problem. Bye. What I see every day bless my heart. Love is hard to find. 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 What I see every day bless my heart. Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. What I see every day bless my heart. I need someone that will love me just the way I am. <coughs> Not what I am. Mr. Adobo, hmm? what is it? Madam, sorry. One man, I come drink this envelope. It's a milk I give you. Let me have it. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Madam, see? I've been done the look. 
You've been not a day happy the way you've been the day happy before, before again. Eh? Now, what thing happened? Hmm? You see, madam, I am an elder. Hmm? If any problem day, make you tell me. So that me, I could fit give you small, small, small advice today with the soft problem. <laughs> Are you sure? Yes, madam. Yes. You see? No, 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 no. You don't need to sit. Oh. Just leave. It's fine. I'm okay. Oh. Madam, I know say I they work for you. I know. But you see, this white hair within my head, not be powder. At all. Not be powder. The thing where my eye don't see for this world, eh? If I begin to tell you, I, it could go help. Mr. Odogo, I said you can leave. Thank you for your concern. I just want someone's love around me. I just want to be loved. I just want to be loved. Ah, what's this? Good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Ah, how are you? I'm okay. You didn't go to work today? Uh, I did actually. Just that I closed on time. Today is Sunday. Oh, that's true. I've even forgotten. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, Thank you. sorry. Um, please, pardon my manners. I would like us to discuss something if you don't mind. Hey, I hope you are not having any quarrel with uh, Madame Divine. No, 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 not at all. Far from that. Okay, so what is it? Um, you already know me. My name is Alex, but I see you as a customer. That's why I don't know anything about you. <laughs> okay, my name is Augustina, popularly known as Tina. Oh, wow. Yeah. I think I prefer Tina. Okay. Um, um, Tina, please. Oh, I don't want to take much of your time. Just that I want us to have a proper discussion. Okay. You can go ahead. Mm, not here, actually. I would like us to go sit somewhere, you know? Somewhere more conducive. Oh. No problem. We can go. All right. There's a place um, around this. This is a document of the ship loaded in China, departing tomorrow to Apapa Wharf, Nigeria. Oh, okay, thank you, Ma. Um, Vivian. Yes, Ma. Please sit. I would love to ask you some questions. I hope all is well, Ma. Yes. I believe we're about the same age mates and you've had your own fair share of experiences in life. Something like what? Why are men so dubious? Why do they lie a lot? I'm sorry, Ma. It, it depends on how you handle them. I've actually tried to be so nice and as accommodating I can be, but they just end up messing me up. <sighs> Ma, I believe that one day your own man will find you. Just keep trying. Anyways, I've decided to shut down the door of anything pertaining men. Like I'm done, done. No, Ma. That's not the best solution. Seriously. You have to open your arms wide enough to accommodate as much men as you can. In that way, you'll be able to select the good ones from the bad ones. So that you, that will help you to date the best among them. 
<laughs> what kind of advice is that? <laughs> Ma, I've, I've tried and it worked for me. In fact, as I'm talking to you, I have just one partner who is even dying for me. Yes. <laughs> okay, it's fine, you can go. Okay, thank you, Ma. I have to go. There's a client waiting for me downstairs. Take care. Uh, Ma, do you need something else? Can no. I get it? Thank you. Okay, Thank you. Ma. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Yeah. That is all. Give it. Come, come, come. I have this for you. Yeah. Sorry. What is this? What is it? What is it? Do you know that Madame Linda's kindness and quietness is caused by heartbreak? So that's why you dragged me all the way down to this place to tell me about Madame Linda. Yes. You know what, Am? Huh? How did you know? I'm pretty sure you are assuming. How did you know? No, I am not assuming. She confided in me today in the office and then she told me everything about herself and how many outbreaks she experienced. Yes. So, Linda will leave everybody that she knows and call you her worker to give her advice. Yes, because I'm her closest friend. Yes. And guess what anyway? <clears throat> After my normal, hey, yeah, I'm sorry, how did it happen? I gave her the piece of my advice because she needed one. When did you start advising people? I don't understand. Well, I don't know, but I did advise her today. And let me tell you what I told her. I told her to keep keeping men and open her leg wide enough you know, for them. She'll be able to choose the best among all of them. I tried now. I've been no try. Give her the best advice. I've been no good. Huh? I'm beginning to get scared of you. I'm beginning to get scared of you. She's coming up. Jude? Yes, Can I ask you a question? Yeah, go ahead. You know, we've been seeing each other for weeks now. So it's safe to ask. Why do you love me? Well, I have so many reasons why I love you. My number one reason is because of your beauty. You're very beautiful. If there's another stronger word for me to use to qualify how beautiful you are, I would have used that earlier. Secondly, your heart. You have a kind heart. The, the, the first day I met you at the mall, um, the level of respect and kindness you exhibited to me, man, was something some beautiful girls right now can't even possess. I think that is the reason why I love you. Wow. And here I was thanking you were in for games. Thank you all the same. You're welcome. And um, thank you for accepting me. You're welcome. Okay. I still have more questions. Okay. What makes you think we are actually compatible? Like we're good for ourselves? You know, dear. I have done my investigations about you. Trust me, the response I was getting are positive ones. You know, encouraging and good answers were coming in from left, right, front and back. So you're good. I'm coming. Madam, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hey, hey, hey. Madam, 
That man, we won't drive that truck. You don't come for interview. Oh, that's fine. Um, tell him I'll be with him shortly. Uh-huh. Hey, 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 madam. Abi, make an interviewer. I'm sorry. Sorry. Sorry about that. Okay. Um, actually enjoying our conversation. Um, but this is an office, so we can actually reschedule for a lunch date or something, so we can discuss further. That's perfect. I like the idea. It's okay, right now. Okay. Okay. I have to get going. Then All right. To do your work. <laughs> Okay, see you. I never knew true love as I never knew. I never knew till I found this. I never believed there is true love in this world. I never knew. I never knew. I never knew. Never knew till I found this. I never believed. I can't find So you've been here and I've been looking for you. What is bigger than the cricket has entered his soul. Please leave us. It's barely two months now since the disappearance of my son, Prince Chief. The hair apparent to this throne and this kingdom. The security agents seem to be doing nothing. They can't even find an answer for me. My mean, only hope. Most when they are doing their best. Trust me. Their best is not enough until I set my eyes on my son. My husband, since the disappearance of our son, I've been having sleepless nights, and I have decided to commit it to the hands of God through prayers. You remember the holy book says we should not behave like men of little faith. Hey woman, I need to be alone. I want to think. I want to be alone. Allow me to think. Lady Gold is engaged. She has been engaged. Wow. See, see the man. <laughs> wow, so cute. Aww. Aww. She's so lucky. That's so fine. Hmm. <laughs> and you? Do you know I did not even know the time you left the office this afternoon? How would you know? When you were busy gossiping with Damaka, how would you how do you expect to see me when I left? I told you you were busy. Well, there is good news. <clears throat> What's the good news? Our uh, madame, our uh, boss, Linda, has found a new lover. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, mm -hmm. So soon? Yes. Who told you? Well, I was at Amaka and she told me everything. And she said that this guy comes to visit her in the office and she can sense that they are so in love with each other. Well? My dear, it's not about being in love, oh. it's about staying in love, make it last. Yes, I pray this one will last for her. That's my prayer for her. I hope so too. I just pray that this one is not a gold digger. Yes, let him not be a gold digger like the other ones. <laughs> my sister, if you don't keep your gold for someone to dig, nobody will dig it out. Yes. She has to she has to level up and protect her heart so that she to avoid heartbreak. That's my own for her. Well, our madam is going to stay in love, be in love, and be happy. You know? <clears throat> Just look at this her love the last one. But she has so far too much. What is your own with her love? You what was sent you? Our madam has suffered heartbreak. She's suffering. She needs to find somebody that will love her. Treat her no, like no, no, a no. nice yeah. woman that she is, like a queen, you what? understand? Oh, Mama, I hope you enjoyed the food. Yes, of course. The food was so sweet. Madam Divine is one of the best cook in the city. So you guys should keep it up. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for the compliment. <laughs> um, I was gonna ask her. Uh, about you know, the
Forgotten, please. Remind me. The problem is to visit. Oh. I waited, but I didn't. I made a promise to come to your place. Oh, I forgot. Um, this weekend will be so tight for me. No, but don't I... bother. I understand very well. You try to answer. <laughs> but you see, it's always good to keep to your promise. Let your words be your bond. It's okay. Um, it's okay. But let's see. I do. Maybe over the weekend I'll go visit. So, so how is your work? Keep it up. Next time. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Oh, that is all I want right now. I just want someone to um, around me. I just wanna be loved. Hey, Madam, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Adol. You call me? Yes. Hey. That's it. I, I go fit stand talk. I insist, Mr. Adobo. You are an elderly man, and I'm aware you know what it takes for one to be happy. My God, do I so, madam? My God. Mr. Dobu. Madam. If you have a daughter, mm. and she's constantly heartbroken by men, what would you advise she should do? Um, my daughter, <laughs> make you know they trust men. Make you know they carry your heart, keep them like that. Huh? Make you try to know if the man are fake, I've been a good one. So, how do you differentiate between a good and a bad man? Uh, uh, now, how it take the do to you? Now, you go take no whether in good or in bad. But uh, my advice be say, no carry yourself, give them. Oh. No carry yourself, give them at all, because. Most of these men, now waiting them go chop, now you some of them they find you. When they don't get the food to finish, they go begin to behave, yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't run. You go be careful with them, well, well. Now what could they call me so? It's fine, Mr. Adobo. We will have this conversation some other time. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, madam. Thank you, madam. Myself at the fill up. You're here. Oh, yes. Um, you're welcome. Thank you. Please have seats, manager. Um, I hope it wasn't that difficult to get here. No. Not really. It's all right. Um, what do I offer you? I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm okay. Come on. This is your first time coming here. At least anything. Water. Drink, soft drink, anything. Oh, come on, Alex. I'm fine. If I need anything, I will tell you. Besides, I'm not staying long. I have to take my leave. Hey! We haven't talked yet. I know, but at least I came as promised, didn't I? I just came to know where my my friend is staying. So that next time when I come, 
could sit and talk as much as we want. Yes. Uh, you know women cannot be trusted. How am I sure you will come back? But I, I fulfilled this promise I made to you, right? Yeah, I am. Isn't it? Um, Alex, I think I have to take my leave now. It's all right. Mm -hmm. Since you said you'll come back. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, bye bye. Yeah, let me see you. Yeah. Yes. The last time she will come back now. Something might happen, and from there, from there, from there, I will hit the target, and woo, we'll fall in love. I never knew true love exists at all. I never knew. I never knew. Baby, you know, I I promise I'm going to love you until death do us part. We're going to be together forever. Amen. Uh, baby, come on. <laughs> this your MM is not convincing. What is the matter? But I just said amen to your prayers. What was I meant to say? Okay, okay. You know, looking at you from head to toe, you always look stunning. Always looking beautiful on a daily basis. Oh, gosh. Enough of the flat chin chins. Hey, I don't on. even know you keep praising me every minute. That's how you still go and break my heart after praise. No, no, come on, baby. I'm different. Excluding me. I'm not a heartbreaker. <laughs> Excluding you, indeed. Yes, you know, Jude, I actually think you used charm on me. Because I said I was never going to love anyone again. And here I am with you. <laughs> hey, come on, baby. <laughs> I don't believe in charm. God forbid. I don't do charm. It's just the Lord's doing, okay? Are you sure? Uh, yes, baby. Come on, pick some more things. Look, I like this shoe. Yeah, I, like think, it? I think it will look good on me. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay, baby. Um, this. Oh. Alex, what is it? Why are you shouting my name? What is wrong with you? Ha! Uh, huh. Did anyone upset you? Why are you sounding this way now? You're acting up. How? single smile on your face unlike you oh. what's going on <laughs> now that i have smiled what is it what again sure you want my smile right this is not the smile i know you with continue smiling eh? let me at least have the confidence to air how i feel see i wanted to tell you that the other day you promised you promised to revisit me i've been waiting ever since and you refused to turn up. Huh? Okay. I took you by your words now. <laughs> Alex. You disappointed me like that. Let me just tell you my mind. Right? Okay. Alex, you are not what I expected you to be. Huh? Oh, yes. Listen, the first time ever that I came to your house, Alex, everywhere was unkept. Your house was so dirty. In fact, it was smelling. Your house looked like we had big leaves. <sighs> Okay, okay, let me agree you're poor, you don't have money. But don't you even have a common, small money to buy yourself cobalt to put the... Oh, those things called pot and play, like those things you use in your house. Alex, you're so dirty. Uh, oh! Jacinta, I thought we are friends. So, eh? As a good friend, what you would have done, eh? Were you not supposed to advise me? Yes. When you saw all these things, you were supposed to advise me or even help me tidy the whole place up or wash my toilet for me. Hey! You women, you know yes, how to yes, wash yes. toilets very well. You wash it for me. I reject it in the name of Jesus. I reject it. Alex, oh my word. You expect me, Jacinta. Oh, take a good look at me, baby. Just look at me. You expect me to advise you or to tidy up that your dirty, smelling toilet. Come on. Hello. We all go to toilet too. No, that type of your own. Your own looks like we're big. She busy a poo. Besides, Alex, shoes have size. You are not my size. I think you should go and look for your size of shoe. I'm not somebody like Jacinta. Excuse me if you don't mind. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Yeah, that is all. I want right now I just want someone once I'm around me I 
just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Does it mean that a poor man will not get married to the woman of his choice in this present generation? What will I do now? I have saved some money, but what will I do with it? To clean up myself and then pretend all is well. By so doing, these ladies will be attracted to me and I will marry the woman of my choice. But what happens after the marriage? They divorce me when they find out I don't have money. No, that is one thing I never wished for. Every woman needs money. So it is hard to dictate the one that is coming for true love. Anyways, let me stay keep saving. One day, it shall be well. It shall be well. I don't need Africa. What I need is a new love. True love. True love. This love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. What I see every day breaks my heart. Hello, baby. Hi, Jay. How are you? You're here, I'm fine. Yeah, baby. You're not ready yet. Yes, honey, but... Babe, come on. There is no but. There is no but. Honey, you know these things can actually wait for some other time. Hey, come on, baby. We're hanging out with my friend. And I've already told him. <sighs> okay, you win. On that <laughs> note, I would have to round up and I could change into something better. Okay. A smiley the places. <laughs> okay, so I just have to back off. Alright, baby. Okay. two hours we've been here and you've said your friend has to come before you tell me the reason you brought us here yes baby i did i did but what's happening i don't know what is keeping him and his number is not even going through really yeah let me just try it again since you didn't schedule with him to come maybe i did so why is he not showing up no, it's not still going through. But you know what? See, I think we just have to go ahead. We can't keep waiting for this guy. Okay, fine. So in his absence, you can tell me the reason you brought us here. Baby. You have captured my heart. I have fallen in love with you. And I want you to become the mother of my kids. Linda, I love you so much. Please, will you marry me? Yes, baby. Go ahead. Go ahead. Atlantic Company. Oh. Mm. 
So you are here and have been looking for you at your office. Well, I came in here looking for Madam Linda, thinking she was in her office and I met everywhere upside down. So I just decided to help her fix it. Ah, mm -hmm. you made everything up there. I decided to help her. Madam, do good. Keep doing good to someone who won't appreciate you, who don't even deserve it at all. Ah, come, Vivian. Hope you know that Madam Linda is still the boss and she can hire you, fire you, do to you whatever she chooses. I hope yes, you're aware. I know. Yes. But is that the reason she is jumping from one man to another? Or don't you know, with our behavior, she is indirectly insulting us too. Insulting? Ah. But I thought you said you've already advised her. Abby? Yes, I did. <laughs> but why is she keep throwing money to men? Why giving so much money to men instead of collecting from them? Let me tell you something, my friend. No man worth trusting, not even my late father. Please, um, let us forget about Linda. Why were you looking for me? <clears throat> when you're done, I want to come and see you in your office. Ah, ah. James Bond. Hey, hey. This is Gil. This is Gil. You don't have good news for me. Yeah, I just the service and support. Who do your parents? Any luck? How did it go? Um, sir, we have searched all the nooks and crannies of this community. We have even searched the bush and also sent information to the nearest police station. But still no word, sir. I assure you that there's no hope lost, sir. We'll still do our best, sir. Say when? If he's dead, tell me. And if let me see his cops. I can perform the better rights. No, 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 Your Highness. No, no, no. Oh, no. Nothing. We are talking about, about my son. Yes. How can he be missing in my kingdom? Your Highness, you should be thinking positive. Believe me, Prince Shady will one day walk into this palace with his two legs. Where is Anna Hifu Namba? Ejima di benenensi mban. Oh no, I'll be waiting till then. But I need to see my son. It's my son we are talking about. Um, officer, please, um, as a new of this great kingdom, I want you to listen. listen. You people should, should put more of your vision net inside this. When we are now, we are than a million. We need Prince more than anything now. Please. Do your possible best. Sir, we'll put more effort to see that we yield results. But okay. until then, I am afraid I have to take my leave so I can mobilize boys for the. Okay, um, it's okay. You can go. But I'm expecting a reasonable answer. Hmm? Please do your best. Hmm? You can do Nice. What is going on? How can my son be missing in my own kingdom? Um, Your Highness, have we confronted Mr. Ndoka on this matter? I'm suspecting Ndoka. How can a prince just miss like that in this Abadu kingdom? Ndoka? Jude, I never knew you were serious about this marriage thing. Until now, you're talking about marriage. I don't understand what you mean by you never knew I was serious. I gave you an engagement ring and you accepted it from me. And yet, you're still doubting me. Well, I feel engagement doesn't really mean marriage because myself i've been engaged multiple times and i usually get disappointed in the end you see jude is a different guy i am real i am not like every other guy no i 
I can't wait to make you my wife as quickly as possible. Jude! Yeah. I never knew true love exists at all. I never knew. Oh, oh. I never knew. Till I found this. I never believed there is true love in this world. I never knew. I never knew. I never knew. Never knew. Till I found this. I never believed I can find my soul. Hello. Good day. Good day, is your Konko. How is your family? You are great. This one you are on the road this hot afternoon. What is the matter? Um, the matter is that I'm coming from Palace. Prince Shid is not yet back and he gives the Igwe a troubling heart. Not only the Igwe, but the entire kingdom. Where could he have gone over months? Without the consent of the guards. Are you sure he's still alive? Um, I doubt. But we still have to give the king a consoling heart that he will be back. But my mind is telling me the prince is dead. Um, let's see the cops and do the burial so that. All these things will come to an end. I'm in short of words. Since his disappearance from this kingdom, everything becomes stagnant. No peace. Every day sorrow. So we keep on mourning every day. What else shall we do? I'm now. I don't know. I don't know. What's the update? Any any news? The same old story. What? I'm sure my son Chad is dead. Hmm. I'm only waiting to see his cops. No, 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 no! Baby, what is the matter with you? Nothing. Oh, come on. You can't tell me nothing when you look so unhappy. What is the problem? What's bothering you? Is it, is it about me? Didn't I perform well? It's not about you. Then why don't you open up to me? We are couples. The problem is also my problem. Share with me. Do you really love me? Come on, baby. We have dealt with this issue before. Why are you bringing it up again? I need to be reassured. I don't want you to wake up one day and cheat on me or even change your mind. I don't want you to disappoint me. Okay, baby. You know what? Let's take an oath. Yeah, a blood covenant. Yeah. A blood covenant? Yeah, baby. Something that will bind us together. At least um, for you to be sure that I'm not going to disappoint you. No, that's too far. 
<laughs> Are you scared now? I chose to. Are you sure, baby? No? Alright, come on. Give me that your lovely smile. Come on, smile for me. Smile for me, baby. <laughs> See, um, I promise you, baby. You don't have to worry. I love you. And I'm not going to disappoint you, okay? Okay, that's fine. Um, <laughs> it's fine, we just have the dinner. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'll be there. Hi. <laughs> I, I'd okay, agree to. I will talk to you later. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Mr. Odobu, how are you? That's what I have. I'm fine. <laughs> I happy where where today. <laughs> In fact, today is my happiest day. <laughs> Why? What happened? Because uh, I never see you you day happy like this for a long time before. The <laughs> thing <laughs> <laughs> you can't make me to I can't be happy. <laughs> you such a funny man. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> Is that not a company voice you have in your hand? Hmm? Madam? Yes. One full load of trailer. One come out. Now, I no agree. Because I check the invoice. You know sign now. Really? <laughs> Can I see? Whoa. <laughs> Why didn't Vivian sign this? I don't know. Where is she? You know what? Just no. get to her office and tell her to see me now. Hey, hey. I'll tell her. This is how they steal my goods, right? Alex. Alex, you have totally changed. You are now so dull and, and, and you don't even participate in some chance. What is wrong with you? You were not like this when you started working here. But madam... Shut up! But what? Alex, what excuse you want to give me? I hope it's not the little money that I'm paying you that is getting into your head. Eh? Because you have changed completely. This is not the Alex I, 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 I used to know. Please, if there's anything I can do, I'm sorry. Get to the kitchen now. Get to the kitchen and do what you're supposed to do. Don't come here and for me. I don't need that. Get out. Look at him. That is how people are. They'll be roaming the streets looking for a job. As soon as you give them one, I'll have a buffer. They'll become crazy. I never knew true love as is at all. I never knew. Oh, oh. I never knew till I found it. I never believed there is true love in this world. I never knew. I never knew. I never knew. Never knew. Never knew. Till I found it. I never believed. I can find my soulmate. I never knew. Baby, what is wrong with you? Baby, I'm sorry. Why did you have to keep me waiting here? I'm so you know how long I've been standing I'm sorry, here? baby. I couldn't get Keke. I even wanted to trek down to this place. I, I, I had to wait until I get your own place. I'm sorry. Well, you should have asked me to at least come pick you. Babe, I said I'm sorry now, but at least I'm here. Can we just go? Do you have the document? Yeah. Okay. And you know what I asked you to tell them when you get there? Baby, don't worry now. I'm an expert in everything. Don't worry. No, Just helping. My lover, my heart is settled. Oh, be my delegate. My dreams has come true. Don't you think what you're asking of me is too sudden? We barely know each other. Um, listen. You know, delay is dangerous. When you see someone you like, you approach the person, make them understand that you like them because. Why you delay? Someone else might take your place. 
And that is exactly what I have done. Uh, okay. Up till now, you've not given me feedback. I need little time to think about it. Little time? For how long now? To eternity? No, it won't. It won't get to that. Uh, okay, uh, so when are we seeing next? Very soon. Uh, I'll come to your house. How? You don't know my house and you're telling me you will visit me. So you want to do me a prefu in November? <laughs> no. Oh. Alex, you definitely tell me now. Eh? Okay, um, I will test the address to your phone. No problem. It's all right. I will come. Okay, I'll be expecting you. All right. Take care. All right, you too. <laughs> just Bye. Be I just wanna be loved. Thank you. That is all <laughs> I want right now. I just want someone who's um, around me. I just wanna be loved. Mommy, yeah. why are you panting? You, you, you sounded so urgent on the phone, so I had to hurry down. I don't want anything to happen to my woman. <laughs> Sit. Oh. God. Nothing is happening to me. So, what is the problem? Okay, can you guess? You know, I'm not good at guessing what it says. <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> what is it for? It's for you, darling. I got you a car. For me? Have it. Are you serious right now? Yes, honey, it's yours. I don't want my baby. Jumping from one tricycle to another, I want you to be happy, feel cool, and drive. A car for me? Yes, darling. Oh, okay. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you so much. You love it? I love it. <laughs> You've not even seen it, and you're saying, "Come, come, let me show you." <laughs> So tell me, was it difficult to locate this place? And how are your people? I hope they are all good. Um, considering what I told you, dear. Hey, hey, unless now, Biko, let me drink this drink in peace. Ah, ah, or should I give it to you and go? What is it? Sorry. I can't remember. We talked about many things. I, I told you about um, I needed 50,000 to pay some bills and stock up the house. Um, uh, yeah, I, yeah, I remember you talked about something like that. Um, just that I don't have that kind of money right now. You know, I depend on my salary that comes at the end of the month. So, till then. You made the things I want to buy, she waited month ending. Are you telling me you don't have 50,000 in your account? I don't. <laughs> like I said, okay, listen. At the end of the month, once I get my salary, I promise, I'll divide it into two and I'll give you one. Half? What do you mean half? Not even the complete money. Half is 25 pa, 25 Alex, stop! Stop! I don't like this. You, you are pushing about love. I love you, I love you, I love you. I can't do without you. Now love and got trouble. You love I will eat. I don't understand. You can't even provide the basic need of a woman. And you are here talking about marriage. So, if I decide to accept this my proposal now, Will I stay in this thinking poverty environment with you? This place is retaining. Like, I, I'm not feeling the vibe, of, like, the vibe of this place is retaining. 
Alex, am I going to stay in this place with you? Alex, you are a disgrace to a manhood. Seriously. Why are you saying all this now? Why are you insulting me now? Because I'm blunt. I don't hide my feelings from you. I'm saying it the way it is. I don't see it. You're, you're running too much speed, though. Be coming down. Eh? See, there's a saying that says that two good heads are better than one. <laughs> eh? By the time we get married, you will bring. I will bring. <laughs> we will drop it on the table, calculate it, and use it to do something reasonable for ourselves. We we'll work as team. Calm down now. You don't need to rush, 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 rush Alex. into nowhere. Alex. Alex. How many times did I call you? I don't know again, no. Those are rests for yesteryears. What I have today is what I have. Tomorrow will cater for itself. Alex, can't you see I'm sweating? I can't stop. I can't do this with you. It's not going to work out. Please, I have to go. Ah, just like that. Yes, just like that. Anyways, thank you for the drink. Come now. Let's, let's visit Alice. one or two now. Ah. Inkiru. Enki. I didn't know you're... Inkiru. Get this violent. Jesus Christ. Girl, okay, what is the matter? Hmm? What's going on? Matter how? Which one is the matter how? You've not been to work for two days now, and Madam Linda has been asking of you. Joy. I mean, you can see I've been very sick. This one that you are seeing me like this, I managed to come out this evening to get something to eat though. Seriously, I've been yeah. down. You've been very sick like this with all this makeup. Oh, I hope it's not what I'm thinking of. Because if it's what I'm thinking, you'll just die. You'll die of hypertension and nothing will happen. The world will go on. Joy, is exactly what you're thinking. Seriously. Okay, I'm so tired of living this life in this world. Seriously. I'm like, it's killing me, it's eating me up like a girl. I'm so tired. I'm not growing any younger. Look at Linda. She changes man every now and then. And we, are, we don't even have one. Am I that ugly? Like, like, look at me. Am I that ugly? I don't understand. Please, oh, please, please. Don't hurt to my, my, my sickness, I beg. Wait, why do you constantly compare yourself? Compare your love life with that of Linda. Eh? Listen, God is going to give you your own man at his own appointed time. Mm. So rest. When? Eh? When? Is it when I go down to six feet? I beg, please. They say one man food is another man poison. What you want is not the same thing that I want. But don't worry, I'll see you in the office tomorrow. And thanks for covering me up all this these few days. I actually appreciate it. I'm going. Hello. Okay. Please. Yes. 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 I will try. Thank you. And I want to see your work tomorrow. I say I will come tomorrow. Oh yeah, start going, start going. And thanks for covering me up. You're welcome. Wait, now you cry. Be going. Thank you. 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 Yes, you. Thank <laughs> Take. Hmm? Now, where I go? Carry and go. To your house. It's actually yours. Yeah, Madam. What do you mean, sir? 
Don't think I do. She's not be saying you won't search me. <laughs> Mr. Odo, we check the content first. Check. Hey! <laughs> ah, take her. It all belongs to you. Now, America money? Yes. Hey! It hey. all belongs to you. Hey. Oh! <laughs> um, please just take it somewhere else and count it. Huh? It's yours. It's... You can go take the envelope. You can go, Mr. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. Man, thank you. Yeah. Man, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I'm so quick today. Man, I carry a gun. I'm not carrying me for you, do. Sit yourself. Madam, thank you. Thank you, Madam. Wait, so, where my guy with this? Where my guy? I got in on the side, I don't get more to. Let me pick him up. What's going on? Relax. Who's the owner of this machine? Relax, relax. One question at a time, bro. <laughs> hey, wait, one question at a time. Yeah. Jude, one question at a time. Between me and you, you know you cannot afford this car. This is machine based for them. Guy, what's up now? Just me. Bro, hop in. Let's just pay for us to talk, <laughs> yeah? You are joking. Enter car. As you, as you, as you hop in. Bro, enter car. Enter car. Go talk. Enter car. Go just see you. Come inside. Jude, Jude, as you hop in. Hop inside the car. Yeah, bar. this is Benzo. Benz or nothing. Come inside. <laughs> Luxury or nothing. This <laughs> way. Jude. Uh, what a, what a guy, what are you not telling me? Relax. I got just you now. We will go collect one or two bottles. Now. Hey, hey my guy. guy. <laughs> Kate. Oh, bro. Oh, I'm everywhere. Really Sharp. Oh, no, no. It's not in the apple. It's not playing. It's not playing. I'm like this now. I'm going to be sick. It's okay. We're good. Kate. Hey. Don't be a I don't want them. Make it. <laughs> see, bro. It is any lady that bought you this open car. Open your drink, please. May I open my drink? Drink now. Open your drink. 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 Open your drink. Jude, I should open my drink. Open your drink. We do it together, bro. Open your drink. <laughs> this is my second bottle. Your second bottle. I say, hop inside the vibe. <laughs> it's funny right. day. Funny day. Everywhere is good, bro. I must say, any lady that got you that ride is extremely rich. I, I, I'm telling you. And this is the perfect time for you to make money. Yes, now. Make more money, bro. You know, um, as my wife to be thought after our engagement, it's not nice for me to be trekking on the road. So she just got that one for me. <laughs> oh, more. So. For real, babes like that still exist in this country. Why not? Because, <laughs> guys, see, you need to connect me to that your girl. Yeah. To that your lady, you need to connect me so that she can, you know, connect me to one of those her friends. Oh, oh. One of her colleagues, you understand? So I can bounce back now. So is she your guy now, guy? My guy. You know, um, you'd have met her during our engagement. But you didn't show up. I don't know. But, 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 but it's okay. It's not late. Yeah. Maybe one of these days, can I get to see her? How soon, bro? Um, 
maybe doing our wedding. Hey, Jude. <laughs> no, for real, you're, you're serious with this, your wedding plan of a thing? Of course. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> you know, I have to ask now because you're my guy and I know you. I, I, I thought it's this normal, as usual, shop around. <laughs> No, no, as usual, shop around, clean no, out. No, stop it. You see this lady? Yeah. In question now, huh? This lady is super rich. I'm in love with this lady. She's not like every other girl on the street. For real. This, this <laughs> lady, I won't take her serious. I'm getting married to her now. Jude. Hey, shock you. <laughs> Jude is in love. Oh. Shock you. So, so wait, for real, you're in love. He's oh, no. <laughs> my guy. This lady is super rich, bro. Don't worry. Anyways, I wish you guys all the luck. You know what I'm saying? Thank you know me. I'm always here for you, bro. Thank you. I got you, bro. <laughs> May you luck you. I swear. Just, just now. Oh, baby, if you travel, when are you likely to come back? Mm, I can't really tell, but I'm not going to be long. Okay, but you know I'll be missing you, right? <laughs> of course, I'll be missing you more. Yeah. But be rest assured I'll be back very soon before you know it. Okay. But well, babe, how do you feel like in your office to travel? What, what if clients comes around? We have workers in every department. But I haven't seen any of them apart from the gate man. That's because they are busy in their departments. Okay. So, baby, promise me you won't go there and start looking at any other man because I'm ready to kill because of you. <laughs> <laughs> and then I should be the one telling you that because you already know my heart belongs to you. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, so why don't you end up? Let me take you out for lunch. Mm, very nice. Okay. Okay. So, if my coffee is here, off we go. Okay, baby. Madam, I would like to ask you something. I'm listening. Can I get my salary for last month? I want to send my parents home. Do you send them money every day? No. Once in a while. Don't you have savings? I do, madam. Just that there is no money in my savings for that. Madam, please. I want to send some money to my... to my parents. My, my, my mother is not feeling too well. They need to take oh. her to the hospital. Oh my God. I... What happened? I, I, I hope she's alright. She's not alright. Our house. We, we live in a mud house. And due to the rain, the heavy rain that fell the other time, part of the mud house fell on my mother's legs. Oh my god. Yes, and now her legs are swollen. She needs to be taken to the hospital. Before, before the whole thing will get out of hands. I, I hope she was not injured. She was now, she was scanning us to the door. Other things. So I know more than you. Okay, no, 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 no. Just, just say no more. Eh? At the end of the business today, eh? I will give you some money so that you can go and visit her, okay? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. No, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I will give you some money so that you go and see them, okay? Eh? Ah, I'm so sorry about what happened. Okay. Hi! What is this? Ha! Oh. Uh, Jude. Yeah, bro. Are we not supposed to see your woman today? Yeah, bro. Yeah, you're right. But I went to her office two days ago and um, she told me she'd be traveling yesterday. Wait, Jude. Are you trying to tell me that you don't plan your wife to be or your girlfriend's movement with her? How, bro? How do you mean? Look, as your wife to be, and as the man of the house, she's supposed to take some permissions from you, you know, understand? You know, oh. 
before you're doing any kind of thing. Yeah, bro, bro, yeah, sure, no doubt. You're right, you're right. But the thing is, we have not gotten to that level yet. Okay, but nothing to worry about. She's not staying for long. She's definitely gonna come back very soon, okay? You get to meet her. No problem, if you insist. All right, no bro. problem. All right. Wherever you're going now. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're gonna get to meet her. Don't worry. I can't wait. You know, as your guy now, your Rigi, I can't really, <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to meet your girl now. Don't worry, bro. Definitely, you get to meet her very soon. She's not staying for long, like I said before. I'll tell you. Get to meet her, okay? Yes. No. But man, I can't go see your bunny for it. <laughs> <laughs> I know you now. Bad guy. Don't worry. She'll be back soon. It's alright. That works. Yeah, very soon. Real soon. Nothing to worry about. I just wanna be loved. Sorry, um, good afternoon. I'll, I'll call you back. Sorry, where are you heading to? Um, well, I'm waiting for my taxi. I'm going home. Oh, come on. Let me give you a ride. Let me drop you off. Yeah, don't worry. I'm fine. Hey, come on. I'm sorry, it's too much for you to be up under the sun. Let I'm me just right. drive you. My house is so far from here. I know, I insist. Let me give you a ride, okay? Huh? Come on. My bugger, my bugger, my G. <laughs> I'm a baller. How much is money? <laughs> Vivian, my bro. How are you doing? I'm fine, sir. Wait, wait. <laughs> wait, 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 chill. Wait. Don't tell me you guys know each other. <laughs> yes. Jude, Jude, <laughs> my brother, you caught a very big fish, man. <laughs> I must do it. Excuse me, sir. I am not a big fish. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, baby. Don't worry. He's a joker. Don't mind him. He jokes a lot. Oh, God, there is no joke. <laughs> you know that one. Well, Vivian, my friend here is a good guy, and I must say you're lucky to have him, all right? I'll tell you, trust me. Bro, oh, it took the light play now. What's up <laughs> now? I'm happy to introduce a girl to you before all these talks you're saying. Don't sure. Guy, what is there to introduce? Is it Vivian? I know Vivian very well. You see, you're my right hand man. I forget that thing. So, what do you want to introduce to me? Eh? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Come to get something for it to bring. Well, you guys are looking good together. Waitress! <laughs> bring me Pepper Super as well. Let me join my guys now. Do your Office. How are you? You can take your seat. Thank you. Any good news? Um, your Highness, we are still on it. But here with me is Detective Pauline. She was sent from the force headquarters to help take up the investigation from where we stopped, sir. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you, Your Highness. Your Highness. Detective Pauline is a well-trained professional in digging out things. So I believe that soon, as quick as possible, I will see my son. We will do our best, Your Majesty. 
But before then, I would like to speak with every member of the royal home. The maidens, the girls, including all the elders in council. All the elders in council? That will not be a problem. I can summon them tomorrow. First thing tomorrow morning, see what I've done. Sorry, my highness. We don't have much time. Delay is dangerous. I need to take statement from each of them to be able to carry out the investigation. That's okay. That's okay. Guys! Guys! God! Hey, baby. You're so good and you look so beautiful. <laughs> oh, my God. You are good. I mean, you are hot. <laughs> I tell you, there's no woman that will come in contact with you who will ever want to leave you. Hey, you hey, come on. Even you too. You know, do you think I'm going to let you be? <laughs> um, <clears throat> um, are you married? Not again. You've asked me this particular question countless time, and I've told you I'm not married. Okay, forgive me. Um, how should we go in? Come on, well, why are you in a hurry? I thought you were sleeping over. No, that's because I'm going to office tomorrow, and you don't expect me to go to office with the same outfit, do you? <sighs> Anyway, if you say so. Hold on, I, I, I got something for you. Take oh. this is for you. Okay. Um. Take. Why are you giving it back to me? Because this four thousand naira is enough to take me home. Hey, baby, this this home one is for you. At least your your performance was top notch. What? Come on. <laughs> I didn't do it for money. I am not a prostitute. I'm in love to you because I love you, not because of your money. Uh -huh. You love me. Come here. <laughs> Come here, baby. Stop embarrassing me. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Oh, thank you. Oh. <sighs> Good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Yeah, what do you care for? We have rice, we have jollof. I don't need anything. Please, I want to see Madame Divine. Oh, okay. Uh, she's not around at the moment. I have to wait for her. Okay, no problem. I will wait for her. It's all right, yeah. Thank you. I'll let her know once she's back. Okay. Uh, uh, are you sure you don't want anything? <laughs> Drink, soft drinks? Uh, I'm fine. Thank you. Okay. This girl, you're looking extremely happy today. What's going on? Guess what, girlfriend? Just guess what? No, I'm not guessing anything. What's okay, happening? okay, wait, just calm down. I will tell you because we are still at work, so I'm going to make it very short. Mm -hmm. I just met this guy. My own God sent. My own Mr. Cute Girl. <laughs> of course he is. The guy I've been waiting for all my life. He's here. Hey, hey. Why did all this one happen? Hmm. How? Like, <laughs> pull me through. Babe. Hmm. See, the thing just happened. No, just quack, quack, quack. You just be like, say, the, the remote time. It just happened. And the guy is already talking about marriage. Seriously. And I can't wait to invite you to our wedding. You know what? <laughs> After what we're going to celebrate. <laughs> of course, we girl. Need to celebrate I am this going to great achievement. I am going to spoil you. I'm gonna spoil you. <laughs>
Hello? Hello, baby. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> yeah, I miss you too, baby. Yeah, I miss you too, baby. No, come on. Don't say that. I love you more than you love me. I've missed you a lot. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. No, no, nobody's looking for my trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> my baby. I hope you're having fun over there, right? Yeah, baby. I miss you too. I miss you too. No, come on, babe. You know I love you too. Really? Next week? Oh my God, baby. I can't wait to see you. Next week, just around the corner. Yeah, my love. I can't wait to come and pick you up, my love. Alright, baby. I love you more. Stop it. I love you more. Wow. Okay, baby. I love you too. I love you more. Bye. Wow. Oh my God. She's coming back next week. I can't wait to see my baby. Yeah, I'm ready for her. I can't wait to pick her from the airport. Oh my God. <laughs> Vivian! What's up, babe? Yeah! I hope you're not planning to steal Madame Linda's family business from her. Which one is still? She called that she's coming back. I have to worry her down here to tidy up the office before she arrives. Oh, that was quick. That was a very quick trip. Which one is a quick trip? She has been there for over four weeks. Hey! Please, I'm not doing my report on this. I need to go and tidy up my end. I don't want to be caught up. No, 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 no. I'll see my cousin. I'm coming to your office. Wait, what are you doing here? Baby. Wow. You came to see me. How do you know I work here? Wait, you work here? Of course, yes. Since when? Oh, I've been working here for a while now. Oh, you didn't expect to see me. <laughs> no, that's not a problem. I, I, I... to say yeah. Explain. It's not what you think. I'm sorry. I can explain to you, please. I'm sorry. Please, I'm sorry. I can explain, please. It's not what you think. I'm sorry. Please. Madam said, Look, you come out now. Come out. Come out. Come. Come out now. Go. I 
How long have you both been in this relationship? It's not up to three weeks, ma. You both met and fell in love in this company? No, ma. There was a certain day I was closing from work. While I was going home, he, 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 he offered to drop me at home. And? And since then, he has been stalking me and telling me how much he loved me. I've tried severally to ask him if he's married. And he said no. And why did you both choose my office instead of a hotel room? Listen, I'm aware this has been going on for a while now. No, ma. Ma, that was the first time. I'm so sorry. I swear to God, that was the first time. I, I, I promised you that I would never try that again. Ma, please. Take this. I wish you luck. Please. And a piece of advice. Trust no one. Ma, please, I'm begging you in the name of God. Please forgive me. I will never try this again. I'm sorry. Leave I'm... my office now. <laughs> Ma, please. I don't want to say it again. Leave my office. But I don't have any other place to go. You know, having a job in this country is... I'll leave. Please. I'm sorry. Miss Ago. Let's have your job now. Just rejecting everything. Oh, Your Majesty, let's quickly go and eat something. I don't want to eat you anything. But you have, you have not eaten anything all day. Please eat something. I don't want you to fall sick. I don't want anything bad to happen to you. Is it not better I die alongside my son? Maybe God forbid. How would you say a thing like that? How can I, I stand to lose the two most important people in my life? Instead of you to, to die, I'd rather die first. I don't want anything to happen to you. Don't say that. My son has been missing for too long. What am I living for? Please, it's put our son now. It's okay. Go away. Come and join you. That's not true. We are going together. Otherwise, I will not go because you will not come after me.
Madam, that man don't bring the car. Now the key be this. Good. Let me have it. Hope you're examining the car. Yes, madam. We do am well well. Mm. Okay, you can go. Madam, sorry. That man, now who him be? I said you should go. Okay. Mm. Okay, madam. Chude. Chude. It wasn't even up to four weeks that I traveled. And you're already cheating on me with my own staff? God. In my own office. Who would have thought you could even have a heart to treat me in such manner after everything? Hmm. Honestly, it's high time, messy time, that they be between their legs. Honestly, I am done. I am done with men breaking my heart. I am done with unworthy men making me feel worthless. God. This has to be my last. I can't do this anymore. Do you know I'm so ashamed? I'm so ashamed on your behalf. What is all this? How can you bring yourself that low? Eh? How can you chip in yourself like this? Joy, but well, you know I never knew that Madame would come back that time. You and I know that she always comes to the office in the evening each time she returns from her trips. I wasn't expecting her that time. And so? As you were not expecting her, it was okay for you to, to make love in our office. Eh? To be romancing in your boss office. Does it make sense to you? Eh? Does it make any sense? And to think that the person in question is her fiance. Guy, you fuck up. But Joy, how am I supposed to know? Eh? I was asking that fool. Are you married? Are you in a serious relationship? And he said no. How was I, how was I supposed to know for crying out loud? Oh. So that means you even fell for a first star. Do it, please stop. Hi! Hi, I thought you were sharp. I thought you were a sharp person. Eh? Are you not the same person that said, I cannot trust any man? Eh? I cannot trust any man. Even my father. Yet you fell for a first star. Joy, please don't hurt me. Please. Don't, don't, don't do this to me. No, don't hurt me. How was I supposed to know? My only problem right now is that I don't even know my fate in that office anymore. Well? That is left for the person you were romancing her fiance to decide. Yes. My only advice for you now is that you will set alarm this night. Wake up very early tomorrow morning. Go and meet her. Explain to her. Tell her that you did not even know that it was the same guy that was playing you that was playing her. Explain to her. I know she has a very good heart. And she will listen. <sighs> you don't even know the shame attached to it. The get man was there. He was there looking at everything. Where am I going to hide my face? How am I going to hide? I just feel like slapping you. How am I going to hide my face? When you were kissing and, and romancing the guy, you did not think about shame. We did not even. Please, please, your own is getting too much. Yeah, Better come and beg her. Oh. Better beg her. Shameless girl. <sighs> Love is hard to find. What I see every day breaks my heart. Love is hard to find. 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 Love is h
Young lady. Good afternoon. Uh, how can I help you? What are you doing here? Um, I saw the notice. I don't know if they can employ me so I can work as one of the staff. Like this? Well, you will have to come see my madam. She's inside. She's the one conducting the interview. But I doubt she will employ you because of your looks. Please, can I go inside and see her? Sure. You can. Thank you. Calm down now. Let me show you the way. Why are you in a hurry? Are you sure you came alone? No, no. I'm not seeing you as someone who can work here. I want you to go home and think about it properly. This is a restaurant where people come to eat. You are here to serve meet people. Okay? Ma, please, it's just that I saw the notice and I rushed to come here. I would have gone home first, please. Before coming here, and even when you saw the notice, you would have gotten yourself here before coming here. Ma, please. The truth is that I need this job, if not for anything, so that I can see food to eat. Please, you need to employ me. Ma, please. Okay, go home and get yourself to come. Ma, I felt that if I went home and came back to this place, someone else might have taken this opportunity. Ma, please give me this opportunity. You won't regret it. Go home and get yourself a hmm? Okay, I'll come back. Ma, does it mean I have the job already? I did not say so. I only said you should go home and think about it and come back prepared. That's all I said. Okay, Ma, thank you, Ma. Ma, I should go home and come back. Yes, please. Okay. Thank you, Ma. God bless you. Thank you. I just want someone's love around hey. me. I just want to be loved. I just want to be loved. This love is hard to find. Hello. Uh -huh. How are you? How did it go? Hope it went well. She said I should go, go home and think if I really need this job and come back. You should go home and think if you really need it. Ah, ah. That means she has accepted you now. And go to the house now, arrange yourself and come back. Are you lucky? Oh, I was even thinking with the way you look, eh? She would think you will not be hard working. But thank your stars. And go now, be going. Brother, there is a problem. You see that my house is far. It's very, very far. I cannot go to my house now. And even if I want to go, I don't have any money on me. That is why you have to start going home now trek eh? you're a young girl now start trekking so that you get home on time and you come back with supposed to go immediately eh? i have things to do it's far i can't trek to the place i have to take so many buses before i get to my house you're beginning to sound like you came from the village but there's, there's, there's no problem um, my house is not far from here mm -hmm. so i'll do you that favor uh, just come to my house, freshen up. Hmm? Then we'll get you one of this. Uh -huh. Then you start work. Brother, huh? you want to take me to your house? Not to pass the night or to sleep, or just to freshen up uh, so that you change into what we wear. Brother, thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. God bless you. No, Allah. God bless you. It's just that I'm in a good mood today. So what will happen eh? Go to the back. Eh? Let me go through here. I'll meet you through the back door. Let me remove this and change into my normal clothes. Just wait there. There's a door there. Wait for me there. I'll follow the back door. Let me change. Hmm? Be going. I don't, I don't have time. Oh, before my madam will start looking for me. I just want someone's love around me. I just want to be loved. I just want to be loved. Love.
Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. What I see every day breaks my heart. Love is hard to find. 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 What I see every day breaks my heart. This love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. What I see every day breaks my heart. Um, Alex, please go to the kitchen and help them with the pounding of fufu. Neka, go and help Linda with the dishes, okay? Good. And both of you continue with the cleaning. Good. Alex, uh -huh. do you know you're too polished to be working here? Polished? Who's talking about being polished? Hey, I'm here for greener pasture. If you did a farm, fine boy or fine girl, hungry, will kill you in this country. <laughs> See, I need money to pay my bills and to send some to my aging parents. Uh -huh. you talk about polish, who fine boy? But, see, it's like that, Madame Divine. You are her favorite, though. <laughs> I'm a cool one. Oh, she gets to like me the way she likes you. Continue dreaming. Nobody is that woman's favorite. Mm -hmm. uh, stop dreaming. Today, she will like you. Tomorrow, she will hate you. She behaves like weather. Weather? That means she changes anyhow. Just like ha. the way Camellia yeah. changes. Camellia is not the first just focus and do your work, that's all. It is. What if she pays your salary one month end to? Because that's the reason I came here. I don't want anybody to owe me. I need money. You see, when it comes to salary, Madame Divine does not owe. Uh, she even pays before ending of the month. Uh -huh. And even if you need uh, money from your salary as a result of uh, you having an emergency, uh -huh. she will lend you. Come on, she's a good woman when it comes to that aspect. I like that one. I'm happy to hear that. Don't go and borrow your salary before months end. Please go, Joe. What's so wrong with like you? I'm liking it. Hmm. I've always wanted to ask you, where are you from? Me? I'm from Isiana. Isiana? Yes. I'm from Ezema and my dad used to be a hunter. Seriously? Yes, but he's late now. He died during his hunting activities. Then I have a mother too, but she's blind. She's just a poor widow. You see why I need this money? I really need this money to take care of my mother in the village. Your dad was a hunter and he's late. Yes. Why your mother? She is blind. I, I thought mine was lost. Well, anyways. Are your parents dead? No, they are not dead. And as I said, I thought mine was lost. I didn't know yours is even. Well, it's alright. Um, I'm so sorry about your, your loss today. 
It's fine. It's all right. It's fine. So, um, what about you? Your mother, you said she's blind. So, who's taking care of her? It's our neighbor. There was this my uncle that was taking care of my school and all. But he changed his mind because he wanted to sexually molest me, but I didn't agree. Huh? Yes. Hey! I did not. This is this uncle. Eh? I know if that uncle of yours should be your father's younger brother. That's how they behave. How do you know? That's how they behave. You see these unwicked uncles. Eh? Mm. What will punish him? My dear, that's how I found myself here. I need this money. At least to be sending to my mom so she can take care of herself. I understand. I understand. Thank see, God I got the job, Sha. Yes, I'm see ya. You just have to keep pushing in life. Eh? Soon, all will be well. Just make sure you are using your salary rights, okay? I just pray. I'm not an extravagant person, you know. I know. See, it's like that coconut rice has food. You can inform them of the chicken. Even the chicken is remaining only two. Go and tell them. Two talking to chicken. I never knew true love exists at all. I never knew. I never knew till I found it. I never believed there is true love in this world. Ah, what's this? Why on God's name are you screaming my name? Why are you screaming my name for? Vivian, calm down. You need to talk. Talk about what? Do I know you? Vivian, see, I'm sorry for the other day. I'm very sorry for what happened. You are a fool and you will remain a fool till the day you will die. What is it? Vivian, it's me, your Jude. It's me, Jude. It's me, Jude. Go to hell and rot without your so-called name. Don't you ever come close to me again. Vivian, come on. Vivian! God be God. You have missed your love. Greedy people, you have missed your luck. Selfish people, you have missed your luck. Dangerous people, you have missed your luck. God diggers. Yeah, here's your phone. Um, I hope you don't mind. Before you start eating, I would like to say something. I would like to know your name and also have your phone number. Okay. Yeah, because I would like to tell you something via phone. What's the reason? Come on. Obviously, you're not wearing any ring. It shows you are marriageable and ready to mingle. Excuse me? How dare you talk to me like that? What's wrong with you? Are you stupid or what? I didn't use any abusive words while communicating with you, so why are you upset? I just said give me your phone number, that's are all. Are you mad? Are you stupid? What's your problem for crying out loud? You don't even know me, you walk up to me and be telling me about marriage and relationship. Hey, why are you ranting? Why are you raising your voice? Excuse me, don't talk to me in that manner. Hey, listen, listen, listen. Hey, I advise you, you put down your voice. Why are you raising your voice? Excuse me, don't talk to me in that manner. I did not insult you in any way. Okay, can you just have your seat? Excuse me, stop telling Nonsense. You look better when you sit. Just sit down. My madam is coming. Don't it's go. better. Don't, you you don't, look don't. better when you're sitting down. Just go sit down. How dare you? How dare you leave your fifty hand on me? Alex. How dare... What is it? Oh, shh. Customer, what is it? Is that how you train your staff here? To change any woman that comes here to eat? I'm, I'm, oh, I'm sorry about what happened. Please, ju just relax and eat your food, okay? Alex, get out of this place. Go away from here. I know how to treat people like this. I obviously will talk to him. Okay, ma. Please okay. warn him, okay? I will. I will. I will. Enjoy your meal, okay? Thank you so much, ma. Thank you. I really appreciate it. How can she be so disrespectful <laughs> and wicked hearted? Huh? Wait, do Alex, let me ask you. Do you know that girl from anywhere? I don't. I was only admiring the handwork of God. Yes, I saw her and then I decided to compliment her beauty. And then what I had was blood on my face. You were trying to compliment her. Okay, you have seen the result of your admiration. <laughs> hey. So that's what you have to say. 
Are you sure you are not like her? Good morning, Madame Divine. I summoned you all to discuss an amazing report that we're getting about to The one that brings tears to my eyes was the incident that happened yesterday between Alex and the lady person. Henceforth, if I get any report about any of you, that person needs to be here on the is that clear? Yes. Smart. I'm sorry, ma. I wouldn't want to waste much of your time to get this station. Go back to your In fact, envelope is your complete salary for the month. Ah, but madam, this is 12th. It's not ending of the month yet. I know. I don't want you around this place. Hey! The war has been terminated. But madam, I apologized for what happened the other day. I know that. Alex, I don't know whether you are here for women. Or you are here to make money so that you can take care of your parents. Just a few hours ago, I was complaining about your closeness to every woman that has entered here. And for you to take a simple correction, I don't understand. You can't even take a simple correction. Madam, please. Eh? I, I promise it will not happen again. Uh, I took all the corrections though. Yes. And you will start seeing it henceforth. You will start seeing the corrections. You are no longer needed here. Let me advise you. Hmm? Better you go to a salon, ladies' salon, or ladies' boutique to look for a job. I think that's where you fit in better. Uh, well, madam, I, I have been apologizing for this same issue I'm now. I'm done with I, you, Alex. I'm a in fact, I'm a changed person now. Alex, I'm done with you. Madam, if I see any female customer, I will not near them again. Just give me another chance now. Are you still standing here? God. God. Where would Madam Linda be for God's sake? Eh? We have searched everywhere, but she's nowhere to be found. What kind of problem is this? Madam Linda, where are you now? Huh? Madam Linda! Hey! If to say, by the time we are there for soldier, eh? Where are the army? Eh? If I don't go brigade, brigade barrack, go call all the soldiers, make we scatter begin the final. Eh? Of, of what use is it now? I beg, allow me think, oh, allow me think, oh, God, go. When I, when I was in the in the army artillery, I am a soldier, old soldier. I'm going to die. We we'll go find her. I'm going to leave you. I'm an old soldier. So none of you saw her the last time she was. Oh, did you not even see her when she was leaving through the gates? Eh? eh? 
Are you not the one at the gate? I did not see her. I did not see her. In fact, all of us, we are suspecting you that you know where Mother Linda is. So I beg, make I go back to the gate before another person will disappear. Can you imagine? I just wanna be loved. I just Alice. wanna be loved. Yeah, that is all. Alice. Right now. I just want someone wants um around me. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. This love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. What I see every day breaks my heart. Love is hard to this find. Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. My please. I want you to tamper justice with mercy. I believe he has learned his lesson. Just give him another chance, ma, please. Alex has not learned it. has it. A man without a penny in his pocket is going about looking for women. How will he maintain this? Is it the little money he's been paid? The money that he's supposed to use to take care of his parents? Eh? Ma. Please, I can assure you that he has learned his lessons. Trust me, ma. You are assuring me? Yes, ma. Do you know him before? Or do you have anything to do with him? No. Ah. No, ma. It's just that that day that I, I came, I met him outside. And I also feel he's a hardworking man. And he's, he's, he's ready to learn, ma. Please, just forgive him. Alex is hard no doubt about that. Yes. But I want to give him time so that he can get himself, himself together. Let him get his ass together. Let him be himself and ask himself some questions. So let him rest for now. Okay? Let him, let him get his ass together. Okay, ma. Thank you. I had him such a Searching, searching for love. Now I have found love. Mama, I'm looking for love. Papa, I'm looking for love. Good. How does it go? The hangers are good. Sit down, sit down. Come to me. Your hangers. Ask for a new good woman. I Yes, yes. I No talk. Our journey is fruitless. All places we go, we are told they saw him was just a resemblance of him. What of the state of Poland and her team? With them. They have gone to the station to give report before coming here. Hey! Oh no, my son is dead. No, 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 no. My son is dead. Your Highness, the Crown Prince is still alive. Believe me, Your Highness, one day, one day, our Crown Prince will walk into his father's new seniors. And you want me to believe that or not? Believe that, Your Highness. God of my ancestors. Alex. Hey. What's happening? I have been here for you these days. Even when I call you, your phone is switched on. What's going on? Nothing. Forget that one. I brought you good news. Really? Yes. What oh, good news is that? Madam Divine has asked me to come and call you back. Uh-uh. <laughs> You're not excited. I've gotten another job. You've gotten another job? Which company? 
mortuary. I bet cops. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. You bet dead bodies. As in mortuary attendant. Bam. God forbid. Ah. No now. Now Lex. The restaurant business is better now. See. The salary I get from being a mortuary attendant is far better than what Madame Divine has been giving me. Uh, it's possible, but I don't think it's actually better. Well, you would have at least used the things you've learned from Madame Divine. Start up your own restaurant. Hmm? You know what? See, I want you to leave the mortuary work and come back to the restaurant. Please now, for my sake. I'll think about it. You think about it? Huh? Oh, wait. Is it this your hand? You used to bait dead people? Mm hmm. It's just that I usually wear hand gloves. And huh? each time I am baiting them, hmm, they will even smile. <laughs> smile? Mm -hmm. huh. That's what I'm paid to do. To make them look good and feel good. You don't touch me with this your hand again. Ha. Ha. Yes, now. I told you I usually wear gloves and there's this chemical. After the whole thing, I'll sterilize my hands. Eh? Mm, don't be touching <laughs> me again and let's stop. Stop. You have mine though. Wash your body. Dude. Stop. <laughs> Anyways, it's not a bad idea as long as. The job puts food on your table and you're happy doing it. Mm, now you're talking. You know, this is my favorite. Uh, this is the food of life. Do you, do you care? Gary Ah. Uh, even more granite. Mm -hmm. Only two. You want? Which one is I want? Have I eaten today? Okay. Hmm. Don't worry, we'll drink it, will be enough. The amount of plates I washed today. When I... Hand. Oh, so sorry. Now red. Oh, so sorry, so sorry. Don't worry, when I pour water inside now, we'll allow the gari to for stay... Everything. We'll allow the gari to stay for like two minutes so that it will rise. You don't want to pour everything? No, no, no. Let's finish this one first. This one is one cup. That one is one and a half cup. Mm -hmm. Just pour the... I had such a... Searching, searching for love. Now I have found the love. Mama Muga for love. Wait, we are going to wait for the guy to ride. Almost done, ma. Please hurry. Yeah. Yeah. Hurry. Our customers are waiting. It's almost done. Please. Alex, our customers are waiting. Yeah, ma. I'm on the final stage now. Please hurry. Hurry. Oh. Ah. Linda, are you okay? What is it? Pepe. Ah, take it easy. Eh? Take your face away from the Pepe, okay? If you me, I'm almost done. It's just to finish the rinsing of this meat then I'll start uh, I'll boil it steam Pardon what? You have finished paying for this. 
You must pay for this thing. Linda, 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 what's going on? What's going on? This? Hey, Matthew, this blind man, he was just walking in here and now broke this plate. It's all right now. Is that why you want to strangle him? Do you want to suffocate him? Eh, eh, Alex, stay out of this. This boy must pay. He must pay for this plate. Linda, it was a mistake. I've told you pardon already. Which mistake? You had him, he said it was a mistake. Which stupid mistake? Are you blind? Which stupid girl were you talking to that, that, that I couldn't see? You must pay. My friend said I should wait for him here. And I don't have any money with me. Use the POS. Use the POS. Uh, uh, Linda, Linda, Use the Linda, calm down now. He just said he doesn't have any money. Listen, this boy is just talking nonsense. Even if Madame Divine should come here and say she leaves this boy, it's not possible. He must pay. I hate men. Okay, okay, Rock okay, okay. Calm down now. Just calm down now, eh? Okay, leave him. Just leave him. You I'm not leaving him. I'm not leaving him. Madame Divine. That's how they go about looking for women to deceive. Madame. You don't have shishi. And you're just gallivanting everywhere. You must pay. Linda, you must pay for this. Ah, yes, yes. What's a womb? What's a womb? I... Alice, but I told you to stay out of this thing now. Have you seen now? It's sorry, okay. sorry. It's, it's, oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, relax. Listen, I will pay the money. Why will you pay? <sighs> Like Sorry, but I was only you to not not to. Oh, yeah. Calm down. Calm down. Now. Where is the money? It is in my bag. Give me the money. I now. have money in my bag. Eh? Just just carry the tray. God has saved you. Deceiver. You don't have money and you're just walking everywhere. Useless men. It's okay, man. It's okay. Keep going, man. Um, come to think of it, Linda. Why were you so aggressive towards that man? I don't understand. Wait, you were expecting me to pay for that plate with my own money? Or even wait for Madame Divine to subcharge me? Well, you were sounding as if you knew that man before. Like, have you met him somewhere? No, I don't know him. It's just that I hate men with passion. How can a man dress and be walking around, no money in his account, looking for a girl to deceive? Men? What do you mean by men? Eh? Um, yes, madam. Do you know the implication of fighting with a customer? Do you know? My broke our plate. <laughs> and even when you noticed he didn't have money to pay, why didn't you allow him to go? He would have let me handle this instead of taking matters into your hand. Ma, please, I'm sorry. It's not happening again. It's not happening again. You are sorry? <laughs> Did you just say that you're sorry? <laughs> that man that you disgraced. He's one of our regular customers in this place. Do you want to drive my customers away from me? Sorry, sorry. 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 You are sorry. You are sorry. You are sorry. You are sorry. By the time you, by the time you drive all my customers away, you stop being sorry. Where do they usually bring people like this from? What is even happening? Can you imagine me receiving strokes of gain from that Madame Divine or whatever? For what now? Honestly, I'm tired of this life. I don't think I can continue to do this. Honestly, God is going to punish this man that made me embark on this rubbish journey. Just, just look at me. Hey. Uh, oh, sorry, I kept you waiting. I had to go a little bit far to get the socks, especially to get something chill. I know you like it. This way. Thank you. 
Hey, you look disturbed. Are you okay? I'm fine. Are you sure? Alex, I'm just worried about what Madame Devine did. Can you imagine? I know how you feel. To be honest with you, you were wrong. Yes, you overreacted. We all know that customers are always right. But what you did out there? As if you knew that man before. Maybe you guys had issues in the past. I hate men with passion. Well, I am a man, myself inclusive. Every man that has balls in between his legs. Ha! Um, hold it. Stop generalizing things. You're referring to me as well. I've got balls. Alex, exclude yourself. You're not included. I'm even coming this close to you because I feel you're kind and well-mannered. Besides, we even work in the same place. But I just hate men. Uh, listen, it's okay. I understand how you feel. I don't know why you're saying all this, but yeah, we are all entitled to our various opinions. So, it's okay. Have your drink. Thanks for the Fanta. You call me. Yes, um... Madam Lindy called and asked me to carry out some of her assignments, so that's your salary. Mm -hmm. Joy, this one will be saying now you can they give the salary now. You know, be say you know where Madame Linda they hide they. You can't they hide them away from us. No one to tell us. Odogo. Eh? I can swear with my life, my generation to come. I don't know where she is. I don't know. You sure? Anyway. <laughs> okay. Thank you for the money. Mm. But if you know, tell us who. Oh. Yeah, I don't know all the staff think that I know about Madame Linda's disappearance. I don't know. I don't know where she is. All I know is that when she needs me, she will call me and tell me what to do. I don't know. Alex. Yeah. You said you wanted to discuss something with me, that I should come to your house. Yes. For the past two months, we've been working at Madame Divine's restaurant. I feel like I have come to know you more than before. Really? So what do you know about me? Mm -hmm. I know you to be a hardworking lady that is striving to survive and i also know you are from a poor and loving family a no-nonsense lady as well are you also contented with what you have is that all you know about me if there is more why don't you tell me you forgot to add a school drop out who was constantly raped by her uncle. And 
I have no one to help me. Well, all that doesn't matter. All in the past. You think so? Mm-hmm. So now you know everything about me. I need to know about you as well. I already told you about me. I don't remember. Maybe you can remind me. <sighs> it's all right. Let me retreat a little bit. My name is Alex. I am from Emo State. My parents are poor and loving as well. I work at Madame Divine's restaurant so that I will be able to take care of myself, pay my bills, my rent, and send money back home for my parents for their upkeep. So, in a nutshell, you know me now. I see. We're actually on the same page. Hmm. Yeah, if you say so. Nice to meet you. I would have to leave now. Um, one more thing. I have gone far and near in searching for this love. All I got was fake love. All I got before was fake love. But now I have found my love. My heart is settled. Oh, be my head, my dreams has come true. I never knew true love as is at all. I never knew. I love you. I never knew. What? I never believed there is true love. You heard me. You're sick and mad in the head. What? I never believed. Linda. I can find my Linda. Soulmate. I never knew. Linda. I never believe that I can find my heart. I never knew. I never knew till I found it. I'm sorry for today. Hey! I know this man. Yes. I know this man very well. My, my eyes cannot deceive me. Yes, yes. Do you need anything? Ah, I'm okay, I'm okay. Um, the young man that brought food for me here, does he work here? So we have many workers that are working here. So who in particular are you talking about? He's looking fair. Fair? Yeah. Sir, so, I don't understand who you're talking about. But ah. anyone that brings food here, it means that person is a worker. Oh. Well, sir, do you, are you sure you don't need anything? It's okay, it's okay. You are fine. I'm fine, thank you. So I should leave. Ah, it's okay. Thank you, I appreciate it. the restaurant like that. Alex, I'm talking to you. Answer me. I don't feel like talking to anyone. Okay, I'm sorry the way I left your house the other day. Please, talk to me. I don't want to be disturbed. 
Alex, I'm worried the way you are. I don't want you to be like this. How is that your concern? But I just said I'm sorry. Considering taking my life, I have thought about it over and over again, and I see no reason, not even one reason for me to continue living in this miserable world. If there is any reason for me to continue living in the midst of this deceptive people. Around! A world that is full of deceptive human beings. Human beings that cannot be trusted. All the love and affection I have shown to these women. Yet, all they could do is to remind me of how poor I am. Did I create myself? Did I? Alex, please, you need to stop. You can't possibly think of taking your life because of this reason you just stated. No! Taking your life or even thinking about it is a sin before God and man. You might be poor physically. But trust me, you're not poor in spirit. All you need is to be patient. Please. Patient? I should be patient. For how long? No woman has ever shown me genuine love. All fake. Deceptive and conny. You mean no woman has ever loved you genuinely? I've gone far and near in searching for this love. All I got was fake love. All I got Alex. before was fake love. But now, since no woman has ever loved you. Let me be the woman to love you from my heart. I never knew true love is at all. I never knew. I never knew till I found it. I never believed there is true love in this world. I never knew. I never knew. I never knew. Never knew till I found it. I never believed I can find my soulmate. I never knew. Have you washed all those clothes? Yes, ma. Are you sure? Yes, ma. I'm sure, ma. Did you tidy the kitchen? Yes, ma. Now, it's not by standing and answering me, yes, ma. Have you done what I asked you to do? I've done it, ma. Good morning, sir. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, sorry, uh, food is not here for you. Oh, I know. I'm not here for food now. I just want to have a word with you. Oh. Okay, please sit. Thank you. He's the one that Alice was talking about now. Him? Yes, ma. So you are the same man that's after their family life in the village? Yes, ma, exactly. That's what Alex said? Yes. You mean? After somebody's life, God forbid. But that's by the way, can I at least sing and talk? He's not around. You can come back some other time. It's okay, no problem. I'll, I'll go and uh, I'll come later. <clears throat> All right. Yeah. All right, thank you. Hi. 
Kahim. Yes, ma'am. Who keeps so innocent? Exactly. He has a symphonic heart. Who be a Jolonjo in the village? You mean that man I saw chasing you is actually after your life? Yes, and that of my parents. <gasps> Alex, you need to inform the police. Yes. Police? I don't have money to carry on with the case. And remember, before you win a case in this country, you must be the highest bidder. Also, I don't want to remind myself of the past. Let the past just remain there. That's okay, I understand, but I feel... Oh, listen. I have been wanting to tell you this. I have been saving some money. Yes. I am considering quitting working at Madame Divine's restaurant. If you agree to marry me, I came up with the idea of you starting something lucrative with the money, you know, for you to have source of income at least. Then what are you going to do with your life if you give me the money? I'll continue hustling as a man. If you ask me, this whole marriage thing, it's happening so fast. Why don't we just take it a step at a time? You get to know my people and I get to know yours. And eventually, if this whole marriage thing works, then it's fine. I feel we are rushing things. If you say so, no problem at all. We have to travel to see my people and then yours. Okay. Mm. So, what did you cook? I got indomie. I have been searching, searching, searching for love. Now I have found love. Ma, please, I want to discuss something with you. I want to take permission from you to travel to the village and see my mother, to know how she's faring. But you can always call her and see No hyperlation. True, ma, but I want to see her one on one. It makes me feel better now. Three days time, ma. Yes. Try and be back and be back in peace, okay? Okay. You can see Alex no longer works here. And we're short of workers. Make it in peace. Okay, ma. Thank you, ma. You came with your bag? Yes. Why? Oh, no. <laughs> I guess Madame Divine has sacked you. No. I actually took permission from her that I'll be traveling and we'll be back in some days. I came here because we'll be traveling tomorrow morning, so I don't want to waste your time. We can actually go from here. I can't remember telling you we are traveling tomorrow morning. Alex, no, we're traveling to your village tomorrow morning, if not for anything, to clear the rumor that you're a ghost. What? Me, a ghost? How? Yes, that's what everyone in the restaurant have been saying. Considering the facts, the way you even disappeared the moment you saw that man at the restaurant. That's what they've been saying. Everyone thinks he a ghost. Me disappeared. 
Yes, they all feel he ghosts. It's better we just stop the rumor. Let's go to your village. How am I a ghost? Disappeared to where? Am I not the one here with you? This is flesh and blood. This is I me. didn't say that, they said. So prove them wrong. Let's go to your village tomorrow morning. Um, listen. I've heard you. But I'll let you know when we are traveling. Okay? No, Alex, we're traveling tomorrow morning, right? Like I said, I'll let you know. Okay, yeah, no problem. I have been searching, searching, searching for love. Now I have found love. Mama Muga for love. Mama Muga for love. Did you travel again? Good morning, Ma. Good morning. I wanted to travel, but I realized the money I saved wouldn't be enough for my going and coming, so I decided to save some more. What I see every day bless my heart. This love is That's God's Thank you, Ma. You're welcome. Ma. What are you looking for? I don't need a God I don't need a free. Has it been long? He's not been working in his palace as a This love is hard to find. Nigwe called me to come fix the pump. I am a plumber. Shit, my son. I don't believe you are the one we are seeing here today. Well and alive. I am the one that I have to disguise myself. To see if I will be able to find someone who truly loves me. I resorted to my English name, Alex. No one knows me as Chidi. Ah. Love me, man. You should have defended me of what you thought it was a challenge. Come on, man. Sincerely speaking, we all know you people would not in any way buy to such an idea. Chidi, we thought you were dead. I was so scared. We were so worried about you. So, this girl in question, have you confirmed she's your wife? Absolutely, ma'am. So she loves you? So why is she not here? Why didn't you bring her? So that we all can celebrate. Because... <sighs> I decided to come first, not to take you people by surprise. Whoa. I'll go over tomorrow and then I'll come with her for you people to see her. No, no, no. That won't be necessary. I said it. You are the real son of your brother. I said that you are taking after me. You have done well, my son. He has my color. <laughs> so he should have my head Nobody as well. Nobody put in that. <laughs> Welcome, my son. <laughs> Thank you, Dad. Thank you, Mom.
Hey, my friend. Hey. You are sleeping. I'm sleeping, of course. I'm so happy. Our oh, prince, prince is finally back. Ah, I'm so happy. Ah. I'm super excited, you know. I'm it's so happy. Someone is not Ah, oh no, you are welcome. Hey! Hey, hey, hey. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, why, is he, why is the prince that came back? Nah, he's inside with the king. Is that? Oh, God of our land. I know he must come back. I say he must come back. Hello, he's very fast. Let me get something for you. Let me get something for you. Why did you travel without telling me? Despite you said we won't be traveling anymore. I haven't traveled yet. Then where have you been for the past three days? Your phone has been switched off, Alex. I told you. We are going to travel. But I don't have enough money for us to use. For transportation. I had to go meet some of my friends, you know, borrow money from them. So, if that was the case, why didn't you tell me? So, at least we could match the money we have and it will certainly be enough. Um, it's okay. I have gotten the money more than enough, as a matter of fact. So, when are we traveling? We need to take permission from Madame Divine for travel. I don't think I will take permission from her again. I will just travel. What if she declines? I don't know. But you just have to because when you return from travel and she tells you she doesn't need your services anymore because she did not tell her you were traveling in the first place, what will you do? I will find something else to do, maybe hog pure water, fruits, or even start a petty trade as you suggested. Or even look for work some other place. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, wow. You are such an amazing soul. One in a million. Exceptionally awesome. I love you. I love you too. I have been searching, searching, searching for love. Now I have found love. Mama Muga for love. Papa Muga for love. Is this where he's stopping us? Yes. I need to go and play. He says, what are we doing here? Um, I, I came to get our house key. My father is here, actually. They are judging a case in the king's palace. Okay? Let's just go in. I get the keys from him, then we leave. Um, sorry. Yeah, you said them um, five or uh, fifty, right? I have got far and near, been searching for this love. All I got was fake love. All I got before. I think I can it. No, it's too inside. I have okay. found my love. My heart is settled. But you may have been good. My dreams has come true. I never knew I come my place. Wait for my friend. 
Tell me who you are or you will never set your eyes on me again. Hey. It's a long story. Cut it short. I disguised myself just to find that special woman that truly loves me in all sincerity. Why did you choose me? Because you are the only one that truly loves me for who I am and not for what you will get. Listen, I went through a series of heartbreaks in the hands of my exes. They were all with me because of what they can get and not for who I am. I was traumatized. I felt so disappointed in myself. I came up with the idea of going out there to work in that restaurant just to make myself look like a struggling young man. My son, my, my friend, Dad, brought out for you and mom. But why are you standing outside? Let's go inside. I have been searching. Searching, searching for love. Now I have found the love. Mama, I'm looking for love. Papa, I'm looking for love. Good day, Mom. Who comes in? Good day, Mom. Who is she? Remember the girl I told you about? My wife to be. She's the one. Your wife to be? In this your world, you're a prince. On the next one, you will come as a pauper. That this thing will be your wife. Hey, Mom. She is not a thing. Her name is Linda. And that is the name of a snake. Ha ha. You don't, you know that? Lola, Lola, please sit. Sit. Sit down. Let us know if it's really doing this with the right eyes or senses. Oh, of course, it's not doing it with his right eyes. How can you go all out there to bring this thing in her buluku? She's not even properly dressed to come to the palace. Madam, out. Hey. Out! Get out! What are you doing? Mom, come on, mom, please stop it. Linda! Mom! Did you hear her name? They said Linda is the snake. No, 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 mom. So That's I the will... snake! Mom, I will not accept that. Sit down. Sit down. Mom. Nothing on this earth will come between Linda and I. And that is the honest truth. Listen to me. I have it in mind to tell you this. <sighs> but I want her to leave first. But your mother was faster. How can you? How could you bring her into this palace? Don't you know that you're a prince? You represent a nation, a kingdom. You don't just bring anything to the palace in the name of marriage. Mom, Dad, you all witnessed 
the series of heartbreaks I experienced in the hands of those materialistic and deceitful girls out there. They were all with me because of what they get from me and not because of who I am. And then I disguised myself. I, I disguised myself to be a struggling young man just to find someone who truly loves me and God helped me to find Linda and here you people are going against the choice that I have made after the whole trauma the whole pains and that is the Linda yes and now you people are kicking against her that means you don't want my happiness, Dad. Mom, you don't want my happiness. After all, I went through out there. Once I step out there, and I don't see Linda, consider me gone forever. What? Son? Linda! Son? Linda! Chedi! Does that mean he won't come back again? He just found a wife. Allow him to be with her. Thank you for not leaving in the afternoon. Perhaps I wouldn't have been able to endure the heartache this time. You can't blame me. I was pushed and I'm sure you would do the same if you were in my shoes. I went through a lot in the hands of those my deceits for materialistic excess. <laughs> they were just after what they can get from me. None of them bothered about my love and affection for them. I went through hell. Go away. Where we are supposed to go to? <laughs> You're not going anywhere with me. Just give me the money. I can take care of myself. Shama. That's my name. My friend, give me the money. You're wasting my time. <laughs> okay. How much are we talking about? What? How dare you drag money from my hands? <laughs> of course I dragged the money from you. You have this money. Why not spend it when you are alive? Listen, I have tolerated your ill-mannered attitude for too long. It has to stop. I just started. What? Did you just walk out on me? Shoma! Shoma! Oh. Hmm. Okay. 
What is Tupurim Chin? I am fine, Dad. You are not fine. I know my son when I see him. Now tell me what's troubling my prince. It is Rebecca. How do you mean Rebecca? What has Rebecca done? I have always trusted her, Dad. I know. Do you know that Rebecca has been cheating on me? No. No, son. Rebecca is not sort of person. I don't want you to listen to rumors and gossips. That allowed her to take her away from you. Dad, it is not a rumor. Neither is it a gossip. I got the information that Rebecca was with another man in a hotel. And then I took it upon myself to go see with my two eyes. And guess what I saw, Dad? Rebecca was with this man on the bed, naked. What? No, that's unacceptable. Rebecca! Listen, come here, come here. Dad, come, come. Come, son, come. Respect. This is disheartening, Dad. Why are these girls like this? I am so heartbroken. Listen, son, son, take it easy. Just take it easy. Don't take it too far. Hmm? She's not your, definitely she's not your own. None of these girls deserve my love. They are not worthy of my affection. I am done, Dad. I am done with each and every one of them. Calm down. Calm down. Sir. Take it easy. What is all this? Why are all these girls like this? The one you feel you trust cannot be trusted. What they need is money. Money is all they want. When is my son going to get his own woman? What is going to be siphoning him? <laughs> wow. You mean you actually went through all this in the hands of women? Wow. Yes. <laughs> Even more. But I am happy to have someone like you by my side. The feeling is mutual. There is something special about you. Tell me. Each time I tell you about the series of heartbreaks I experienced in the hands of those my materialistic and deceitful exes, I always noticed this mix reactions on your face. <laughs> Here um... we go again. And then, I'm beginning to wonder. Hope you are not going to disappoint me like those other women. Because if you do, I don't think I will ever survive it. No, I won't. Are you sure? Yes. Um, come on, Alex. We need to sleep because we're leaving first thing tomorrow morning. It's getting late. It's all right. But I want my parents to apologize to you for using those demeaning words on you, my wife, today. <laughs> Smiling again. Smiling as usual. Mm. Let's sleep. Good night.
Mm -hmm. We are living that. So we are. Where we came from. Are you going with her? She, she knows her way. She can find her way back. She a baby. Hey, don't you know where you came from? Take it easy. You can still go back to where you came from. I said, take it easy. You heard me, Mom. I said, we are living. Son. Son. Both of you should sit. Sit down. I gave you my phone and sit down. Sit! Why who's up all of you? My daughter. Mm -hmm. We are sorry for what happened yesterday. You know? What you don't know is bigger than you. My son, the prince, has been insisting that he must marry you. And we as his parents has no option than to allow him and give him our blessings. Thank you, Dad. Thank you, Highness. Well, in our tradition, we insist to know the family where we are plucking the fruit so where are you from who is your father and what do you do for a living she already told me everything we need to hear from her that's a mouth she used to tell you let her use the same mouth and tell us what she told you hey, Mom. obviously She's becoming emotional. And that's because she only speaks about her background at her convenient time. Oh, even if it's after one year, we'll keep waiting. Not that, Mom. But we just have to. Please. Alex. Please, I'm sorry. What? Your Highness, the truth has to be told. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Yeah. That is all I want right now. What just... truth? What are you talking about? Your Highness, my name is Linda Ofebu. I am from. Akamoye, in Eziagu local government of Enugu State. My father is the owner of Ofebu Shipping Company and Ofebu Holdings PLC, Nest Level Hotel and Resort, and many more. What? Linda? What, what are you talking about? My God, we used to be friends. A favorite travel agency always prepare my documents whenever I'm traveling to abroad. They make my journey so easy. We've been doing business together for a long time, but I heard that he's dead now. Yes, Your Highness. Oh, that shall never end. What? He's my father and I'm his only child. But he handed over all his businesses to me. What? I'm now in charge. Oh. Alex, please, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. You lied to me. Why? Why would you have to hide your true identity? Alex, we are both on the same page. I'm 
Sorry I had to disguise to find true love. It was just unfortunate that men who were coming to me were gold diggers. They were just after my money. I'm glad I found you. Alex, you won my heart. And I promise to forever be submissive to you for the rest of my life. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. After all, we are on the same page. I hid my own identity from you just to know if you truly love me as well. Not knowing you went through the same heartbreaks from your exes. It's all right. I promise to always be by your side. Nothing. I mean, nothing, not even in the afterlife. Would anything come between us? I love you. My love. I love you so much. I love you more. I know you do. <coughs> My daughter. Please, I am sorry for the way I embarrassed you. And I'm so sorry. I, I understand my pain. In situations like this, it's actually inevitable. I understand. In this whole thing, I learned one lesson. To respect everybody. Not to undermine anybody based on circumstances or status. I'm sorry. Alex, I'm truly sorry. You know, this whole thing reminds me why I keep laughing each time you tell me how fake women have been to you. I'm glad we're here now. I love you. I love you too. And I will always love you. Till the end of time. I love. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. That is all I want right now. I just want someone who's um, around me. I just wanna be loved. I just wanna be loved. Love is hard to find. Love is hard to find. Mm -hmm. Honey, are you set? Yes, my darling. My love, you're going to accompany me to the office tomorrow. I need to check on my staff, at least to know how they're faring. Okay. But wait a minute. Are you telling me? You left all the responsibilities to one of your staff all this while? Yes. Whoa. Joy is very capable and well experienced. You heard me talk to her yesterday. Yeah. They actually believed I was missing and they were about to report to the police. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. But the truth be told, you are indeed a smart angel. <laughs> <laughs> I admire your wisdom, honestly. Thank you, honey. So, what next? Are you going to leave your property in the room while you were working for Madame Divine? I already told my neighbor, Moses, to take everything in that room. I don't need them. Hmm. This is Chidi, and that was Alex. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what, honey? Oh, not again. 
You know I am not good at guessing. Just try, you never can tell. Mm. No, I want. I don't want to fall my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell me what is it. I love you. <sighs> you actually thought something else happened, right? Yes, yes. And I love you too. I... I said I love you because I mean it from the deepest part of my heart. And I will always love you for the rest of my life. My love. I'm glad I met you. Thank you for loving me regardless. Thank you too. <laughs> I'm glad I met you. Honey, we are running late. We need oh. to leave now. Woo! Oh, that's true. Johannes, I am very happy for our dear friends. Yeah? I told you, Oyanata. I know our crown prince must come back to this palace. You are right, brother. Yeah? I said it. You are right. <laughs> that is why I summoned you. <laughs> yes. I want you to summon all the council of elders. So that you people should go to our in-laws and fix a date for wow. the ma marriage rights. Wow. Yes. <laughs> um, Ernest, when do you think the date will be fixed? Just no, it has to be between us and our in-laws. So anytime they choose and you people agree with them, I don't want it to be prolonged. <laughs> Let it be soon. Consider it done, okay. Ernest. <laughs> Consider it done. <laughs> I know that our face must come back. Uh, I'm a neighbor, no, 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 I share with us. Not only you, but the entire kingdom. kingdom. <laughs> okay, let me be on my way. Okay. <laughs> Linda, Alex, so you two disguised yourselves all this while? What a mystery. Uh, madam. Yes. We are here to invite you to our royal wedding. And to also say a very big thank you for all you You are indeed a wonderful woman. Thank you. You won't go. Your wedding. Did I hear that right? Your wedding, both of you. We will close this shop. We will close everywhere. In fact, no business that day. I will gather all my friends. I will make sure that my workers, your former friends, my former workers are there. Bring out that day. It's for you. Congratulations. I'm happy for you. <laughs> Linda, Linda, congratulations. Alex, congratulations. Um, please, why don't we go inside? Okay, yes. I never knew. 